Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So for today's video, it's going to be a tutorial on how to make the pattern on a DIY tutorial that I made the other day. So um, I received a comment saying that you want me to make a video on how to make this pattern and it made me realize that I didn't explain how to make this pattern on that video. So I'm making a separate video just for the pattern guys. So to make this pattern guys, it's really simple. You just need four measurements. You will need the bust measurement, the waist measurement, the distance between your bust to your waist, and then the length of your top. So for the length of your top, you would want to get your tape measure and wrap it around your neck like so. Make an X in front of you and then adjust it to the length that you want. So mine, I want it to end at my waist area. Now for your bust and waist measurement, you want it to divide it into two. One for the front piece of our top and one for the back piece. Now let's start with the back piece of our top. So over here, we have 17 inches. This is half of my bust measurement. And then over here, we have 14 inches. This is half of my waist measurement. Now the six and a half, this is the distance between my bust to my waist measurement. Now let's move on to the front piece of our top. So this one, this is my bust measurement. This is eight and a half, which is half of the back piece of our top. So 17 inches divided by two is eight and a half. And then over here, this is seven inches, which is half of our back piece. So 14 divided by two is seven inches. And on the side over here, this is the same six and a half inches. This is the distance between my bust to my waist. Now for the length of our top, this is 20 inches. This is where I use the tape measure to make a cross in front of me and I just divided it into two. And then over here, this is two and a half inches. It's not really that important. I just wanted my neck area to be two and a half inches thick. So you can choose to make it thinner or thicker, however you like. And then at the end of this two and a half inch, I just connected it to our bust area over here. And then from the bust area, I just connected it to our waist. That's it for our pattern, guys. I hope you understand it a lot better this time. Um, if you have any more questions, just comment it down below the description box. And also, I'll be linking this video at that DIY tutorial so that it's easier for you to, you know, search this pattern. So yeah, that's it. And I hope you like this video. And if you do, please hit like. Also, for those of you who haven't subscribed to my channel yet, please do subscribe. And also hit the notification bell down below so that you wouldn't miss any of my new videos. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.